Hello YouTube, this is XXXMan360 here, and welcome back to another episode of Fan Refiles. Today we are looking at Five Nights at Candy's Remastered .exe. Thank you to Blippi on my Discord server for sending me this file, and for Emily Mako on GameJolt for creating the game itself. So yes, today XXXMan360 is playing a horror game. Ooh, how spooky. Uh, I see it is also made in Click Team Fusion, like the original Five Nights at Freddy's was. Now, um, be warned that because I'm playing a horror game, if you are afraid of jump scares, then I suggest you click off the video. But for me, yes, I have to live through it myself. Do we? Can we go full screen? Okay, yes, we can. It's always funner, to, more funner, better to play in full screen. So essentially, this is what um, started after Freddy Fazbear's Pizza was closed, just from reading it. A hundred dollars fifty cents a week. Hmm. I'm not so good at this game though, or any of the FNAF games, and their fan games. Oh, nice burger though. You have one message. Hi. Hello. I'm the junior manager here at the restaurant. Okay. I'm supposed to walk you through the job as our new security guard. From your resume, I can tell that you're already a well-experienced guard. But, you know, it's protocol, so I have to walk you through the basics anyway. So, let's get started. We have security cameras all around the restaurant. That's good. And if you bring up the camera panel, you'll be able to view the feed from each camera by pressing the camera buttons on the panel. Now, our lights are always off during the night. Obviously, because it'd be a waste of power to leave them on all night. So to actually see something on the cameras, you can activate the camera system's night vision mode. You activate night vision by clicking on the button of whatever camera you're currently viewing. So for example, say you want to see what's on camera 1. Yeah. You bring up the camera panel, you click on the button that says cam 01, and then to use night vision, you click on cam 01 again. Once night vision is activated, you can click on any of the other cameras and view them with night vision as well. And you turn it off the same way you turn it on. Now, night vision takes more power than regular vision, so make sure you use it sparingly. Your first priority as a security guard here is to keep an eye on the animatronics. Those are really expensive machines, and we do not want them stolen. I get you that. Keep an eye on them through the cameras. We have quite a few animatronics here at Candy's. There's of course the cats Candy and Cindy. There's Chester the Chimpanzee. There's the penguins. Just lots of million. Uh, so. You also have three security doors in your office, each of which can be closed by pressing the door button by each door. These are here in case you're in some sort of danger, but personally I just use them to shut myself off from the world when I need a break. Huh. But don't let me be a role model on that one. Where are remember, the others? Closing these doors takes power, and the longer they're closed, the more power they drain. Now, I know that sounds kind of backwards, but you have to trust me on that one. I think it's something about the doors having an automatic fail-safe feature in case the power gets cut off, you know, so they open up if there's no more power. All I know for sure is that they do use more and more power the longer they're closed, so you don't want to keep them closed for too long at a time. Now, uh, the reason I keep mentioning the power is because the restaurant uses a backup power generator at night, which only has a certain amount of juice in it. I see. So anything from viewing the cameras to using the security doors takes power. You can see how much power you have left on the computer on the desk in front of you. Try not to run out of power. If you do, though, you won't be stuck in the office since the doors will always open up anyway. Oh, and uh, one last thing. The animatronics aren't completely turned off at night, so they might start walking around a bit. But just be careful not to let any of them into the office, because we have stuff in there we don't want damaged or anything. Like me. So don't bother with the ticket booth door. They won't attempt to get in. That should be all. You'll hear from me again on your next shift. Have a good night. Oh. I can't exactly see what's really outside the door, so. Or maybe. Actually. Oh. Yikes. That's a bit too close for my liking. Mainly these cameras you gotta keep an eye on for though. Um 
I don't know where he went. I'm just... God damn it. Oh, there is a door. Okay. In that case, I better keep an eye on it, though. I just wish there was a light like in the original Five Nights at Freddy's. You know, when I was younger, I used to be obsessed with this... With the FNAF uh, series and whatnot. Yeah, that was me being a kid. We have quite a few animatronics here at Candy's. There's of course the cats, Candy and Cindy. I just don't see the chimp and penguins. Penguins, just lots, I tell you. Uh, so you also have three security doors. Are these the only ones that move, though? Though, don't bother with the ticket booth door. They won't attempt to get in through there. That should be all. You'll hear from me again on your next shift. Oh, they don't. They don't come through this door anyway. Huh. I guess that's good to know. Okay. Where'd he go? Something feels wrong. I'm just gonna do it. If I can't find him, I... Okay, he's right there. Eight. Oof, that's getting kind of close. No. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, he's, he went. Wait a minute. Where is he? Oh, he, okay. In that case, I don't waste power for nothing then. He's back there. Okay, wait. Oh, oh he's gone. Come on, almost at 6 a.m. I know we can do this. Almost at the end of the night. Um, ding, ding, ding. Yay! Okay, well, we'll look at the food and then that'll be it. Wait, what is this? Am I supposed to rotate the camera again? Not sure if I want to though. Okay, so yeah, that's Five Nights at Candy's, uh, the first night completed. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it just like, uh, the original, but I guess having only two, I, I think there's only two animatronics to look after? I don't know, I didn't see the other ones yet, but who knows, they probably are there, and just in the later nights. Um, yeah, it was good, our graphics are great as well, it runs very smooth on my computer. Um, I would uh, recommend playing it if you're into that kind. Of, if you're into the FNAF games, I mean, I'm not. I don't really play them anymore because uh, I do other stuff now. But yeah, this was good. So thanks again, Blippy, for sending this in, and uh, Emily Mako, I think, for creating it. 
And to anyone else who is watching, if you'd like to send me your own software, just head down to my Discord server and look for the channel that says, give me software here. You can submit it there, and I will show it on YouTube. That is all, and thank you for watching.